trying to find a place to prop this thing up. That should do it. That should do it. You want to say hi? Chilling out here once again. Uh oh, no dark. This should work. What's up, everybody? Back with another banger. We're going to do another video out here. I just finished doing. I hope that doesn't look horrible. I just finished doing a little bit of um, a little bit of cardio outside. Beautiful day um, in Southern California. Sorry, if this is not going as smooth as I wanted it to. Beautiful day out here, doing some some cardio right outside here in the uh, in the patio. Uh, good stuff. Get the heart rate going. Get um get the blood pumping. Get breathing a little hard. Feels good. Recommend it to anybody who doesn't do it. You do a little bit a day. You don't got to do. Start off with. Obviously you want to 10x everything. You want to go all in with anything you do. But when you're starting off. Just you know. Get your beak wet. And start going little by little. You know. And But consistency. Start doing it every day. Every day. Every day. And then you start turning up the volume. Now I don't mean like in two months. Turn up the volume. I'm talking about do a little bit every day. For three to five days. And crank it up. Uh. I was thinking, you know, people walk by, they they see us, you know, people, they know what's going on, you know. You're doing jumping jacks or you're doing, you know, you're doing burpees or, or what is it, power squats or whatever. If anybody ever asks you, you know you have the, the right to say whatever you want. If somebody asks you, hey, what are you doing? What are you working on? Or what's that thing you're working on? Or what do you got going on? Or you start, you know, working out or you start... Uh, a new side, new side hustle, or you're starting a spit game at somebody, you know, you're starting to go lunch with somebody, or you're, you're shopping around for something new, or you're taking time for self-development, maybe reading, or checking out a program, or, or, um, uh, meditating, people find out you're involved with something, and you're doing something, you know, you gotta be careful on who you share your stuff with, especially if they're going to, if they have the, freedom to vibe out with you let's say you live with somebody who's just you know always negative 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 it's always just pushing just just you know trying trying to trying to you know just someone who's kind of annoying who has who's having a lot of challenges in their lives and they don't know which other way to carry themselves but in a way that reflects their challenges and they pour it on on you because you don't have a choice you know they live you sleep at the same place maybe you, you stay out and you don't go to the, the place you stay at to avoid them but for that period of your life you're staying with somebody who's just the opposite of where you're trying to be or you you have a, you have a co-worker maybe somebody you do business with somebody you work with who's just always talking smack all day and is always you know it, he thinks he's funny, she thinks she's funny, she's just a bully, is what it is, let's call it what it is, you know, and bullies don't need to be kids, bullies, kids who are bullies end up being adults that are bullies, or they transform into bullies that they're adults, there's a lot of grown-ups that I know that are bullies, and the worst ones is the ones that are adult bullies to kids, and I've seen that happen uh, more times than I'd like to, to know that I have, but when you're starting something new, and you got that bully in your life. You don't have to tell them what you're doing. Show them what you're doing. And if they see you working on something. Practice neutral. Diffusing. Answers. No, I don't mean diffusing. Why did I you know? I want to say. Um, what's that word? What's that word? I hate when that happens. Um, find. Words. That will. Just disassemble the conversation. Find words that will uh, answers to the question, Hey, what are you working on? Hey, what are you doing? Hey, what are you trying to do? Practice answers that will, yeah, I guess it is diffuse, that will just diffuse the conversation. I apologize if that's not the right word, but you know what I'm saying. It disassembles it. It, it breaks it down. It doesn't, it doesn't uh, give away what you're doing, and it doesn't engage in more conversation. So you're exercising now or what? No, nah, just my, my, my shoulder hurts. I'm trying to stretch it out. Oh. That's it. I'm not starting to exercise. I, I just got a cramp on my leg and I saw a YouTube video that this helps stretch it out. 
But if you answer, yeah, I'm starting to exercise, dude. I want to get a little fit. I want to, you know, get my blood going. I want to improve my 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 blood um, results, my blood work results. He's you know, start making fun because you're opening up an opportunity for the bully to do what he's supposed to do, which is to be a bully. But if you extinguish it and just say, no, I'm just doing something like that. I got, you know, my back's a little tight and this. I heard that this works. He'll leave you alone. Next day, back's still going. He'll probably laugh and say something, and then she'll leave you alone. Practice these answers. Okay, I know you're going to see me, um, you know, putting stuff, you know, building stuff on the on, on, on my Instagram page or, or, or whatever. Sees you building something there. Or sees you trying to, trying to talk to the girl down the down the hall or the guy or the gal, whatever, down the hall. It's like, oh, so what? You know, you like him, you like her, whatever. It's like, no, nah, it's just friendly. Or it turns out that I known her for for a while ago and she's getting caught up. Don't say, don't don't give up all the information to the bully because it's just giving them material to bully. So what the best thing to do with that is practice your answers. Okay, I know this person is going to ask questions so he can talk smack. These are the questions that he's probably going to ask. Let me come up with neutral and the conversation answers to anything that you're going to do. I mean, I'm just 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 anything, you know, you start you start up uh, Keeping your car clean, you start washing it, you know, start working on it, start cleaning the outside, clean, making sure the inside's clean, and you're going to stay on top of that. You're going to clean it every week. Same with that. Oh, so you're trying to keep your car clean now or what? Nah, I just, you know, I notice that there's like, I, I, I can't find this thing I'm looking for, thing I'll probably, you know, I'll probably in here. You know what I'm saying? Nothing about cleaning your car. You're just looking for that one thing. So practice these just answers that keep on going diffusing i hope that's the word and if not i'm just gonna own it it is it, i'm gonna say that that is the word answers that will diffuse the whole conversation the, the the whole um topic of whatever it is that you're doing don't give away the things that you're doing to people that are not gonna um they could they could support you they could talk good about it they could talk bad about it that's okay, as long as they're talking about you. Like me, dislike me, as long as you're talking about me is a great thing. It's a phenomenal thing. But when you're talking bad about me to me, I, not that I care. Especially if it's somewhere where I could avoid you. But I'm talking about those bullies that you so happen to have to be a few hours with. Because of whatever your current lifestyle is. You always sit with them. You always sit next to them where you get a ride. You always see them in the morning. You always see them when you go to the gym because that's the only time you can go to the gym and he owns it or he works there. And he's always going to give you heat. You got to come up. Those are the situations I'm talking about. Whether people talk good of what you're doing or bad, it doesn't matter as long as they're talking about you. The problem is when people are not talking about you. That means you're not doing enough. It's when you're going to have to hear the negativity or, 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 the, or the hate in front of you and their sole purpose is to bring you down because they get a kick out of it because they're having a challenging patch in their life. Those are the people that you want to practice diffusing answers. Answers that will just shut them up. Answers that won't give them any ability to get traction to continue going. And if they do, it's very little. Because the answers have diffused them or her from being able to make fun of you, talk smack about you, throw shade, whatever you want to call it. you got to diffuse those situations. After you leave, have at it. Talk smack all you want. As long as you're talking about me, that's good. But while I'm there, if you're trying to bring me down because you get a kick out of bringing me down to your level because I'm trying to vibrate at a higher frequency, that's when practicing using the answers that you practiced or the phrases that you practice without getting mad, without getting irritated because that fuels people like that. That fuels people if they see you get upset, if they see you lost for words, if they see you stumbling, if they see you getting embarrassed, if they see you getting nervous. But if you just practice your answers when you're alone, and then you use these answers when you're, when you're approached by this person, you diffuse it, you get to do what you got to do, you get past that, you move on, and you continue, you, do, you continue doing you. That's it. That's all I got for you guys today. Thanks for cruising on in. Appreciate coming into the channel. If it's too bright, my bad. If it's too dark, my bad. I hope you enjoy it anyways. If you enjoy it, 
give it a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy it, give it a thumbs down. With either or, whether it's a thumbs up or a thumbs down, I need you to go into the comment section and let me know why you gave it a thumbs up or why you gave it a thumbs down. If you know anybody that could use this video, if you don't know anybody who's going through this and this video would help them out, help me help them out. And share it with them. Tell them about it. Copy the link. Press the share button. Um, I'd love, I mean, if you could help me out that way, help me help that person out that would just make me warm and fuzzy inside and, and I, i'll take all the help i can get so if you anybody that if you could help me that way and sharing this video for somebody that could use it that would that would mean the world to me um also if you're here for the first time welcome nice to meet you my name is albert um i invite you to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell if you're a returning viewer i appreciate you coming by and that's gonna do it for today's video thank you so much for coming by and I will see you in the next video. I'm gone. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.